Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. So for today guys, I'm just going to show you how to actually deal with the issue where face recognition is not working. In other words, the feature that uses your front sensor up here that allows you to unlock your device with your face is not um, working. If you're having such an issue, I'm going to show you how to actually troubleshoot and eventually fix the issue. So let me just demonstrate the issue. This can happen on the lock screen or when you're setting up the feature. So if you go into um, your setting, lock screen and security, if you use um, face recognition and of course put in my password here and of course it shows you there it gives you the disclaimer you'll have to agree and of course you hit um, continue and of course you see this regular um, icon here but of course you'll get this error here that says face recognition not working couldn't open camera try again so in other words something is wrong with the camera itself and of course this could happen here or at the lock screen so if you're having this issue guys i'm gonna actually show you how to deal with the issue on your samsung galaxy s8 or any other phone with a similar setup all right guys let's get right into this fix for the um face recognition now first you need to know is that the front camera is actually what's used for the face recognition so if it's not working or failing where well, you're getting that error that you saw make sure you check or launch in the camera and see if your front facing camera is working if you are seeing um, camera fail something is definitely wrong with the camera itself and that's why you're getting that with the facial recognition now um, luckily we had a separate article about the camera fail since it's related to the facial recognition so therefore I'll link that one right here so go over there and watch that one actually try all those tips and then come back to this video where I have additional um, tips okay Alright, the first thing you want to do guys is you're going to come like this you're going to go into um, settings and these are additional tips so i'm not going to repeat the ones are as best as possible i'm not going to repeat the ones from the older um videos so you need to go over there so i'm going to go to apps once you're in apps you're going to look for the um face recognition um, features so you're going to go into um, settings then you're going to show system apps and of course you're going to scroll through it's alphabetical and look for face recognition all right so you'll find it down here as face so you're just going to go in face you're going to go to storage of course, if you're in storage, you're going to clear cache and clear data for the face related um, stuff. You're going to come out and, of course, you're going to test the facial recognition again. All right. Another cool thing you could do too, guys, is other than that, you, see, you could go to the camera itself. Once you're in the camera, you're going to do the same thing too. You're going to go to storage. You're going to clear um, data, clear cache, then clear data. All right. Always remember to restart after doing this. Also, although this one is a popular one, you're going to disable Smart Stay. So go ahead and search Smart Stay. And of course, you're going to turn off the feature called Smart Stay. Mine is already off. You're going to turn it off. All right. So those are some of the key things that you can actually do. And of course, if in the case that your device is actually um, the sensor itself is just failing for um, simple reasons, you can also make sure that your screen protector is aligned. Also, make sure that these sensors are clean so there's nothing obstructing them. Or so on also I think you could actually do is you could boot into recovery and then clear the cache partition um, don't worry your data will be safe so what I'm gonna do guys is I'm gonna put a link to how to clear your cache on screen here you can go over to that separate video that's very sharp and actually see how to clear the cache and you can come back again and um, test all right guys so those are the main things that you can actually um, do in order to actually get your device working after you're getting the error that you have seen there um, just remember you need to watch those supported videos or those linked videos. Alright, so this is Ricardo from Blog Tech Tips and bye until next time guys. Bye.